you go. That's running. All right, so uh, as far as pitcher-catcher relationship goes, uh, Brandon just called me, you guys just saw. Um, to be able to have a catcher on the exact same page as you helps kind of take some of the workload off your shoulders and puts them on his. Yeah, I like That's good. Just a couple things that I think helps build that relationship is always being positive back there. Um, even when I, I threw a ball away or I was up in the zone, you know, I didn't hear any chirping back from my catcher. It was just pick up the ball, throw it back to me. Let's see if we got a block on camera right here. Let's see, here it comes through the dirt. Good job. What'd I say? And that's what makes you confident throwing the curveball. I was on the mound right after I threw a two seam that ran completely off the plate, had Brandon set up on the inside part of the plate. Um, and just talking to myself, I'm telling myself, all right, I want to see him set up more middle of the plate. I want to see him, you know, kind of help me compensate a little bit for that movement. And before I even threw my next pitch, Brendan shouts out from home plate, hey, you want me to sit more middle on that? I'll set up a little bit more middle here. Compensate for the run. There we go. When you asked me, you're like, do you want me to set up middle? I swear to God, just because I had this thing on, I was talking to myself, I was like, See if he sets up a little bit more middle here. That way it compensates for the run. Before I even do the next pitch, you're like, yo, you want me to set up middle on that one? <laughs> so when we talk about pitcher-catcher relationship, that's like the biggest thing right there. Especially when you have a pitcher that's on the mound and, and doesn't quite understand fully what he has in his arsenal as far as movement, as far as speed. And it just helps the fluidity of the game and your rhythm on the mound stay nice and solid. When you have to think about all that stuff, on top of not pitching well, uh, it becomes a lot of work. So make sure you get a good relationship with your catchers.